a lady. Her five year old daughter died. When the girl died, she refused to give up. She refused to give in. She had been praying because the girl was sick. Prayed and prayed and prayed for the girl to be well, and she didn't get any better. And finally, just gave up and died. Oh, oh, oh. No! She refused to cry. She refused to cry. She said, Now my girl is well. That's what she said. Now my girl is well. She refused to cry. Now she's well. You know what she did? She started thanking God. She said she was sick. I prayed and prayed. She didn't get any better. And now she's well. And instead of crying, ah, ah, Rachel, Rachel, Rachel. No, she said, Rachel. She's a defeated I'll never be defeated see a lot of Christians give up too soon when something happens and they start crying because things didn't happen the way they were praying for it oh God I prayed for this why did this happen when Lazarus died what did Jesus say they had come to call him Lazarus your friend is sick Jesus said oh the sickness will not kill him that's what Jesus said. Then the sickness killed him. Jesus said the sickness will not kill him, but it killed him. When Jesus showed up four days later, he didn't say, Father, what are we going to do? He said, You heard me. What did the father hear? When I said, the sickness will not kill him. He's a Lazarus. Come out. That's the way you call your business back to life. That's the way you call your finances back to life. Can you shout it? never too late never 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 too late because we are the seed of Abraham all things work together for good to them that love God to them who are the call according to his purpose that's me 